one up and uh, I'm going to show you it running. So this is a X-ray transformer. This is the output just here. I'll actually move this down a bit because it looks pretty cool when it runs like that. Let's get it quite wide. So, yeah, got some nice, some nice uh, outputs from it. Yeah, about there should do. So yeah, so uh, X-ray transformer, Variac for the voltage input, and Variac for the adjustable ballast. So right, I'll uh, I better actually tell you how this works first. Actually, voltage into the Variac, voltage out from the Variac, which is limited due to the variable Variac. Uh, this is the output. You've got your neutral wire here which goes straight into the x-ray. You've got the live output which goes through into one side of the windings. And then the other wire which is here is actually from the contact. So basically you're shortening the inductance. So what I'll do then, I'll uh, show you it working. Turn the light off. Let's turn that off. So I can actually vary and completely turn it all off. So now there's just completely hardly anything going, no, hardly any current going into it whatsoever. So I'm limiting it right down. So if I slowly turn this back up, you'll slowly hear it coming through. So if I just turn that off and bring this closer, you'll see it turn from a sharp output, as in the uh, spiky output, into an actual arc. So let's turn this back up. Sorry about that, a bit closer, because I don't want to burn me me uh, X-ray transformer out, putting too much um, current into it, because I want to keep this one. So that's completely off, and yet there's still voltage going through it, but there's no muscle behind it. Isn't that cool? I've had to put tape on the top of it because this top is actually live. And at the end of the day, because I haven't got it in a box or I haven't got the knob on the other side, I've had to turn it by a little screw I've just put in the top there, which was a limiter for this Variac when it was used for the uh, general electric purposes of an X-ray transformer's control panel. So what I've actually done, I've um, put the screw, a screw on there and uh, put some insulation tape around it and 
insulated the top so they don't catch it and uh, they're only chucking 80 volts into this um, at most uh, into this x-ray transformer but I still don't want to touch the top of there it's uh, uh, not a good thing to do so I just thought I'd insulate a little bit of tape on there so thought I'd share that with you guys hope you enjoyed the video some lovely arcs out there off that weren't they Oof, lovely look after yourself guys thanks for watching and be safe and we'll speak again